Okay, this is my computer before fixing it. You can see the screen is cracked really bad right there at the top, right underneath the camera. Now I want to shut down the computer and take out the battery. Now I'm going to try to pry away the bezel. Take out the screws and the corners. Okay, now the bezel's coming off. <clears throat> I think there are screws under these covers, so I'm going to take them out. Okay, so I'm going to pop out some of these little tabs, and I think that the screws are underneath. Okay. Oops. Okay. Took the tab off. And undo the screw. I'm going to do the same thing for all the other ones as well. Okay, so you can see that there's four places, one, two, three, four, where there are screws. This one, for some reason, doesn't have a screw behind it. I'm just gonna unscrew all of these, take off the bezel. Hopefully the whole bezel should come off. I wanna be gentle, because it's kind of thin. And voila. The whole bezel came off. Now here's the screen, the cracked LCD. Let's see how I can lift this out. Gently lift it up. And you see down here, there's a connector. I think it's probably a 40 pin connector. That's my goal, and I try to disconnect that. Okay, so here's the package that I got just two days after ordering it, which is kind of amazing. Package in cardboard, and package in bubble wrap, and package in more cardboard. And here <laughs> is the new screen. And here's the new connector that I'm going to use. Okay, so here, right above the connector, there's a little piece of tape. You see I'm lifting it up. I'm going to grab that so I can uncover the connector. I'm going to peel it back slowly. Try not to damage anything. And now I'm going to see if I can disconnect the connector. Voila. There's a new one. Looks like it's the right size. I'm going to connect that same connector. I heard a little click, a little pop sound. Hopefully that means the connector is connected. I'm going to reattach that tape. Try to hold it together. Gently going to put the screen into place. And now, before I go any farther, I want to check if the screen works. So, 
Let's see. The computer is working. Okay, so this um, display shipped with a very thin protective layer on top. And you could see that earlier when I had it on, there's like a imprint on there. So we want to peel this off. If I can do it gently. And now I really want to be careful because this is my real screen. Okay. Now I'll put the bezel back on. Okay, so I'm going to start in one corner. I felt it pop gently into place. I heard that pop again. I'm going to keep gently going across. Make sure it all comes into the right location. On the sides, same thing. Gently pushing everything back into place. Almost done. We're down at the bottom. Now I'm ready to put the screws back in. And now I'm going to put the little covers back on the screw holes. Okay, so now all the screws are back in. I put the screw covers on. Final thing, I'm going to put these corner pieces on just to make it look pretty. Okay, that one's in. And this one will hopefully go in. Voila. Perfect. I'm going to put my battery back in. Lock it. Charge it. Final test. Success. I replaced the screen on my Toshiba Portage R830. That's how you do it.